Nicole Zaborski joins me now from the Tahoe Coalition for the Homeless. Tahoe Warm Room, how are you? Hi, Kristen. Well, happy winter. Good, happy winter. It's been a good one so far. Mm -hmm. So fun getting out there and playing. And you are, I know you get out and play, but you also work really hard in the wintertime taking care of those people that need some extra help. Absolutely. And so now that we have a great winter, we also have cold temperatures. It's been yeah. wet. And there's individuals that need temporary winter safe warm place to be and we call that the warm room and we're located at uh, near between Ernie's and the lake house this year at the old dental practice there awesome yeah 1201 Emerald Bay Road so yeah. we're open in the evenings now through um, the morning of April 1st perfect and you do a lot more than housing people that need a place to warm up we do first thing we ask people what is it gonna what what do you need to like get back on your feet so we have an intake form we have a social worker we have you know staff members that plug Oh. directly with them and once they trust and build rapport you know we can you know direct them to all sorts of services sometimes it's getting reunited with families sometimes it's the bus ticket to a better place for them sometimes it's helping them fill out an application for housing or a job um, getting connected to places that mm -hmm. they like to work and would like you know, to work in the community. So that's awesome. We have a lot of fundraisers, and yes, we have one coming up, kind of a, a open house. Kind open of house, yeah. yeah. So our open house is coming up on the seventh from three to six, and we'll give tours of the warm room. Our neighbors, Ernie and the Lake House, are so wonderful to us this year of Yay. just being accepting and you know understanding that this is needed in the community, and they've been great neighbors. So Ernie's okay. is going to be the place that will hold the reception that evening. So we'll have um, the first responders that we're going to celebrate and thank in the community. That includes over the Nevada state line at Tahoe Douglas and their sheriff department at, Wa yeah. at um, Douglas County, excuse me, as well as CHP and El Dorado County Sheriff and nice. the city of South Lake Tahoe and um, the fire departments and the police departments. So we're we're looking forward to just again thanking them. Yeah. They're, they're wonderful, you know, of just being um, always at the ready for the community. Absolutely, and especially for you guys, we were talking during the commercial break about how, how what they have done for you. You were oh, naming off some of the details. Mm -hmm. It's too long to be naming right now in, in the interview time that we have, but really going above and beyond mm -hmm. with making sure that your crew's okay there and mm -hmm. safe, and, and that's wonderful. They really mm -hmm. do need to be recognized, and it's nice you're turning Absolutely. around and, and showcasing mm -hmm. them. That's really cool. Yeah. So it's it, something we all can do, right, as a community. As a community, yes. So come see this space. If you're curious, if you would like to, you know, volunteer, we're going to have another volunteer training coming up, and we are always looking for people who are the cheerleaders who want to join fundraising teams. You know, we have a few fun fundraisers throughout the season. One is at the Tahoe Beach Retreat right next door, uh -huh. and you know, one is our Turkey Trot too, which That's is right. you know at the Rec Center. So uh -huh, in the fall, mm -hmm. yeah. Awesome. So you, you you keep talking about, um, you mentioned a few times that this year, your location this year, do you move? We do. We're nomadic and homeless as well. <laughs> Our organization um, is new and young, so we have not you know, secured a lease or bought property to have a year-round location. Okay. We do have a year-round office, and, um, and then we, our staff go and meet people a lot. So they'll go to bread and broth on their Week, you know, weekly it, meals, yeah. and they'll they'll be there for folks, so that they don't have to then make a separate stop to connect with our staff. Awesome! February seventh is the date of your open house. Thank you Three so to much. Six. See yeah, you there for Kristen. stopping by. Thank you. You do great work. We Thank will you. be right back.